In this tutorial, I'd like to show you Spectrum from Luca Visual Effects. Spectrum is a set of light effect generators and transitions that give you some really amazing ways to stylize your footage. I'm in Premiere Pro, but Spectrum also works in After Effects, Final Cut Pro 10, and Motion. You can find Spectrum in Video Effects, Luca's Spectrum. There are two generators, Light Effect Generator and Light Transition Generator. If I simply create a new adjustment layer and drag the Light Effect Generator onto it, I can show you some of the dramatic presets that are included in the effect. I like this preset called Starlight. We could use this as a standalone background for some graphics, but I'd like to use it to stylize some footage. I'll move the adjustment layer to a track above my first clip, as I'd like to composite them together. For the final result, I'll use a blend mode so we can see the underlying clip. But for now, I'll show you all the options you get in this generator in the parameters. First off, there are two powerful ways to customize the effect the source image, and additional effects drop-down menus. The preset we chose has Fractal as the source image and Zoom Blur as the additional effect. This is the reason that Spectrum is delivered as generators. Changing the image and effects and trying different combinations yields over a hundred different unique looks. I'll jump down to the various controls and tweak the speed of the animation and the amount of glow. Additionally, we have picture controls such as brightness, contrast, exposure, and saturation. I'll use the color picker to push the color more toward a warm, sunny yellow. When you're compositing with these generators, as opposed to creating backgrounds, you can check the Composite on Original checkbox and then adjust the opacity. Or do what I did using an adjustment layer and then composite it using the default host blend modes such as Add, Screen, Hard Light, or Overlay. For this example, I like the Overlay Blend Mode. Because we can customize this effect in so many ways, I recommend saving a preset when you create something you like. Finally, I'll go to the on-screen controls and animate the zoom center dot to roughly follow the sun's path through the sky in the time lapse. This will make the rays wash across for a great effect. I'll next show you the transition generator. The controls are very similar. I'll drag it to another adjustment layer on the timeline and adjust its length to about one second. I'll center it over a cut. I'll go to the Effect Controls tab and change its blend mode to Screen. Now I can check out a few presets. I love this preset, Prismatic Curtain. First off, I'll time the length of the generator on the timeline to end before it loops back around again. In the parameters, you can use the asset dropdown to change the light pattern. There's a handy thumbnail image of each asset to help you choose. At the bottom, you can see the list of additional effects, just like in the other generator, so the combinations are many. You can flip the effect horizontally or vertically by checking these boxes. And of course, you can further customize the effect using the picture controls. Spectrum from Luca Visual Effects is an amazing set of stylization effects that are a must-have for editing dynamic footage using lights or creating impressive motion graphics quickly. It's perfect for backgrounds for text, logos, and pictures, and overlays including light streaks, color, and bokeh effects. Use the built-in presets, create your own, and even stack generators on top of each other for endless combinations of effects. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com.